I also played uh, King and Marduk, I didn't do so well there on the, uh, the other stream. Alright, okay, so... Have you played yet? Get ready What's that? Have you played yet? Battle. Yeah, I beat uh, Will. Played Will, yeah. Interesting. Yeah, it, yeah I like Paul. He's, he's, uh, he's really solid. Yeah, very solid. Damaging, of course. Round one. Okay, so we're getting this underway. No button check. No button check. So this is uh, getting straight into it. So we have Colton, who actually, if I'm not mistaken, I think EVM has officially hung it up. So if that's the case, Colton is the top player that we have now. And he's showing that right now as he just completely really runs through heat in the first round. Yep, uh, he remains consistent will be the, uh, the key threat of the tournament. Yes. <laughs> Sorry, now, he needs to, but he needs to adapt, you know, like what he's good at, of course. <laughs> so we have some footsies going on here. We have US side step swing pistons. Very nice. Going for max damage. Just missed the wall. It's a back one. Oh, this is ugly. Ooh, good break. So yeah, wall rising one two for the uh, victory. Thought he was doing all right. Oh, and he lands a on a unknown location to me, but he lands a kind of hit, and he breathes fire. <laughs> oh, we have a nice punish, nice wild man. Ooh, good pick and firm. Ooh, and Dragon off force attack crash in. Ooh, nice duck punish the wild man. Ooh, Heaton just working that Steve. Just giving Heaton the business and beats with a neutral jumping punch. Yeah, I don't think that was intentional. Yeah, I agree. Ready for the next so Mr. Velvet takes one. Everyone's here pretty much. Pretty much Tekken out. I've, I personally am myself. There's a lot of Tekken going on. So. A lot of Tekken going on. Yeah. yeah. Just to get that yes, that is not a safe string. That is a mid-high. Ooh, good break. And then so we have Kazuya putting on the pressure on Kunimitsu to the, to the Hell Sweep. Nicely placed. We have Rage Steven here, which will do some nasty damage. Ooh! Up forward 3-2. Dirty, dirty move. Oh god, the sway back. Back into the east side. Mm, so we got to the. Well, this should kill, and no, he does not finish his food. Good break. Ooh, and that's barely survives. He even with. And the floor, he's saved by the floor break. Yep, saved by the bell there. When does that happen? Oh, we have nice 2 2 with punish. That does not happen, true. I understand. That does not happen every day. Saved by the floor break. Wow, we have a max range of electric hitting. Nearly sent Kuz across the screen. <laughs> so 
nice, uh, nice parry to Oki option. A nice break. <laughs> Ooh, we have a side C. down two, side step down two. Good break. Oh, no punish. No. Yeah, he's a weakness. He doesn't know a lot of the friends. Yeah. Anything that's not lunch punch for he doesn't really know that well. Ooh, we got the Subaki. And he just needs to awkwardly place electric. Just gets hit out of the string. So we got Heaton putting on the pressure, doing work with Kuni right now, taking the rage from Kazuya. Ooh, he... Ooh, punish. Ooh, back swing blow to drop crown A. Heaton on the... he has game point, gonna take game one. Complaining that he does not have an electric. Ooh, and he, good break. He, uh, Mr. Velvet's been really sharp on his throw breaks today. He not so sharp, eating a four, four, one, four, two by Stu. Yes, all ours needs is an electric, so we can do what's happening right now to him. To him. Ooh, and Heaton is actually the, the smarter option by just maxing out the amount of things he can do. <laughs> and Steve, freeing up them ankles, showing him you must duck. Mr. Velvet about to bring this back. Ooh, and he does a pseudo good punish. So, so far it's, oh no, it's pretty evenly matched so far, and then he's a 4-4-2, which Give him a rage dragon off. Stuff's a hot kick. Nice one break. Ooh. He's a sure you can. A raw sure you can. Ooh, he's a down back 3 2. Ah. Ooh, good break, yeah, Mr. Velvet, and just returns it with a electric for taking game two. Yeah, it looks like uh, looks like he's getting tired. Uh, having the hitbox is a lot different. Uh, moving. Is it? Have you played? Any? Have you played on one before? Uh, no. Yeah, it looks tedious, honestly. Yeah, a lot, a lot more extra. So right now, we are idly sitting at the character select screen, and he switches to Armor King, which I honestly think is a very, very bad decision, because... Get ready for yeah, the Armor, next Armor King is free in the Northwest. So yeah, we have no Armor King. EBM played him last tournament and didn't do so hot. Yeah, he lost twice the same person. Round and one. Fight! But, <laughs> but it's okay, because Armor King does have an unblockable, and uh, Crouch Dash too is you know, it's unblockable, especially online. So we'll see lots of those. So yeah, you have to avoid it. 
at all times. Ooh, and he's just stepping, just dancing around here. A free Friday? Oh no. We already have Tekken Thursdays, having a free Friday. And then with drinks, I can't. Uh, I don't know if I'm like if I feel safe with a bunch of you know, like old grown men drinking around me. Ooh, and he just mixing them up, making them feel, making them feel new. He runs in and gets his slide. He turned him vertical. Sent him straight up into the sky. Well, they don't say what kind of drink. It could be like Kool Aid or Kool or something. It's very possible. You have a point there, Dustin. Yep. It could be. It could be juicy juice. Who knows? That's <laughs> possible. Yes. And oh, he derps his giant swing. Oh man, he just shouldn't even be on defensive, so he's just forcing himself all, all these make-up situations. And he a, eats a down forward 1-2, drop combo. Yeah, the, 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 like, the hitbox is very precise, which is the thing about it, but at the same time, though, I feel like it's very seamless, you know, the, it's like Dustin said, you know, it's a lot more inputs for just, you know, the most basic of stuff. But he makes it work really well, so hey, more power to him. And a hop kick, which we need to do more of. He runs up and just throws him. Heaton is. I'm not. I. No, he's usually all about, you know, aggressing, especially with Dragon Off. He runs in and mixes up really well with throws and whatever, you know, options he's with Dragon Off. But Mr. Velvet causes very terrifying, if I do say so myself. Exactly. Ooh, get, get punished. The one. Ooh, and no punish the second time. So, oh, Shining Wizard, no break. Good stuff. And Heaton still just backing up as he just walks, walks him down. Just boss walks him. Ooh, and he missed the unblockable. When it just just going down on those ankles right now, and he's a sure you can. It's very unfortunate. Yeah, okay, luckily we have a can of Pringles on hand to uh, get the heat when he's gone. Yes. Got some water too to wash out the salt out of his mouth after this loss he's about to take. And ooh, just eats a electric. Ooh, and it is over. Mr. Velvet takes it 3-0.